Hello and welcome back to our Houston Texans franchise in Madden 2003. Today we are taking on the Jacksonville Jaguars in an AFC South showdown. Larry Johnson closing in on 2,000 yards. He's got 1,864 with 20 touchdowns on the season. And here we go, Jacksonville, 7-6. and six. We are 9-4 and four on the season. Last game, we saw Larry Johnson destroy the Green Bay Packers defense to the tune of 291 yards on the ground. The game before that, we saw Randy Moss light up the Detroit Lions secondary. Palmer handing off to Johnson, first play, breaks loose already past midfield, past the 40-yard line and down at the 36-yard line, but unfortunately he is injured and he might not make it back in this game. And there's Desmond Clark on the reception of the 25. Willie Parker now in at halfback, and a nice spin move there, he'll pick up seven. Palmer to the air, pressured and dropped by Wes Moreland, the right outside linebacker, his first sack of the ball game. Palmer going to go to the air again here. And over the middle, deflected away at the last second. And that'll bring on Max DePace and the field goal unit. DePace on for the field goal. He does not get a lot of that kick. And it barely hits the end zone. And I, I don't want to talk about that, guys. Don't mention it in the comment section below. Thank you. McDonald with a nice catch to the 45-yard line. First down for the Jaguars. I formation, Fred Taylor gets a toss and he is dropped by Marcus Washington. No, I believe that was Charles Tillman actually. I don't know anything today apparently, my goodness. And there's Tillman again on a nice play, deflecting the ball away and the Texans will get the ball back. Second and seven, Willie Parker gets a carry, waiting for his blocks to set up and gets close to the first down marker. Third and one, Patrick pass in motion, Parker to the right. Randy Moss lead blocking, and he's going to spring Willie Parker free, stiff arming a defender, and he is gone. Touchdown, Houston. <laughs> what a crazy play from Willie Parker, getting his first significant playing time of his young career. And that was a 60 plus yard touchdown run for the North Carolina Tar Heel product. There's Fred Taylor up the gut, six yard pickup. Brunel right side, Tillman getting torched by Reggie Williams. And that's been the case the entire season. Doesn't matter what coverage I pick, what formation I pick. Tillman, Roll, Sykes, Taylor, they're all getting torched. But our defensive line's playing great this season. Nice tackle for a loss there from big Sam Adams. And there's Reggie Williams running through Marcus Washington. Looking like a little schoolgirl out there, my goodness. Put a shoulder right through his face. And Sean Taylor cleaned it up with a nice tackle. Third and seven. Musa Smith with a nice stiff arm. But he is taken down just shy of the first down marker. And they will send on the field goal unit. And the kick is up and good. The Jaguars are on the board after a 71-yard drive. That took over three minutes off the clock. Palmer scrambling. Finds Moss, but he drops the pass. Palmer should have probably just took off and ran with it. Would have been an easy first down pickup. But the Texans punt the ball away, and Mo Sykes almost has an interception over the middle. Nice hit on Aaron Walker. Brunel to the air again. Entrell Roll gets a deflection. I totally expected him to get burnt again. But he hasn't been burnt in this video yet. Maybe just one time by McDonald. And there's Tillman getting torched again by Reggie Williams. Past the 40. Brunel pressured. And he is hit, but still completes it to Sean McDonald on the left. Fred Taylor with a nice run right side. First down, pick up to the 22-yard line. Brunel, left side. Fred Taylor, wide open. Seven-yard pick up. Third and two, play action from Brunel. Over the middle, picked off by Jamie Sharper at the 12-yard line. He's going to return this up past the 20. Fumble it. And Marcus Washington returns it up to the 27-yard line. Texans going to the air now. Here's Willie Parker with his first reception of the ball game, picking up a first down. Palmer all day to throw. He's going to take off. No, he's got Willie Parker wide open past the 30, the 20, and down to the 15-yard line. Willie Parker is everywhere today. 
doing a great job filling in for the injured Larry Johnson. Palmer to the skies. And that is, oh my goodness, that is caught by Patrick Pass. Wow. Probably the most athletic play of his career. Took me by surprise. Lee Parker is stuffed on third down. And we send on Max DePace for a field goal. I hope he can make this one. And he just barely puts it through the uprights. And our kicking team continues to struggle this season. But at least he made that one. It's Fred Taylor up the gut. Six or seven yard pickup. Third down, Brunel hits Musa Smith wide open past the 30 for the first down pickup. Another third down here, Reggie Williams open, beating Mr. Charles Tillman again. But we do get a sack here from Marcus Washington, his third tackle of the game, third and 14. They're going no huddle. Sean McDonald wide open, beating Entrell Roll on a corner route. And they continue to go no huddle here. Here's Aaron Walker, the tight end. He'll pick up six. A minute to go here in the half. Brunel all day wide open back corner caught by Reggie Williams for the touchdown. And the Jaguars tie it up with 35 seconds to go. But that's enough time for Palmer. Maybe not. He is sacked. Third and 20. 30 seconds to go in the half. And Palmer launches it and Randy Moss comes down with it at the 46 yard line. And Houston will call a timeout. 21 seconds to go, second and 10. Palmer rolling out. Patrick passes wide open on the sideline, and he gets it out of bounds. It looks like, nope, they call a timeout. 12 seconds to go. Palmer going to take a shot to the end zone here, and he will. Randy Moss comes down with it again for the touchdown. Beat the corner on a post route. Nice touchdown catch for Randy Moss. And... I believe Carson Palmer has 31 touchdown passes this season now as Brunel is sacked again, this time by big Will Smith, former Ohio State Buckeye. And that will end the first half with Houston on top of the Jacksonville Jaguars, 17-10. Houston looking to take total control of the AFC South division. Jaguars fighting for their playoff lives. But they're not getting it done on the ground. Only 35 yards on the ground for Fred Taylor and that ground game. And DePace boots it out right side to the four-yard line. And that is Eugene Wilson on the return. And he gets a pretty good one up to the 26-yard line. Brunel right side caught by Reggie Williams. And Tillman brought him down by the face mask. That's another first down for the Jags. Brunel right side picked off by Charles Tillman. He immediately makes up for it. And he's going to run this one all the way back for a pick six. Secondary's been destroyed all season. Every once in a while they come up with a nice interception. But it still does not make up for the fact that they have allowed what seems like a million passing yards this year. But a nice pick six nonetheless for Mr. Charles Tillman. Fred Taylor on the toss. It looks like he's going to get the first down, but he decides to spin back to the inside. And Jamie Sharper is injured. He will return later on in the game. And that pass is caught again by Sean McDonald, this time in double coverage between two former Miami Hurricanes. Fred Taylor, one yard shy of the first down. They'll give it to him again. He's got the first. Brunel to the skies, and he is sacked again. And that was Will Smith getting his second sack of the ball game. Career high for sacks uh, for Will Smith. I believe that is his fifth. Fourth down now for the Jaguars. They punt the ball away after that incomplete pass. We set up a screen here to Willie Parker, showing some acceleration here up to the 38. Parker again getting the carry, following blockers, picks up the first down and another face mask, this time by Eugene Wilson. Second and five, Parker on the ground and up to the 32. Play action this time. Palmer throws it left side. Randy Moss comes down with it as Palmer throws across his body. Third and three. Parker is stuffed in the backfield, and that'll do it for the third quarter of play here in Houston. Texans on top, 24 to 10, as Max DePace casually misses another field goal on the season. This is getting pretty old. Brunel right side, Reggie Williams. This is also getting old. Williams and McDonald have just been a nightmare to cover since they were drafted. 
And there's another catch this time by Casper, and he is gone. He is to the house. There's a slot receiver coming through, getting them within another touchdown here in the fourth quarter. Here's Parker on the ground, breaking a tackle, gets past midfield, jukes inside to the 42-yard line of Jacksonville. But here we go, third and nine, and Justin Fargus comes up with a great catch and a first down. Second and 11, Palmer pressured, hit. He fumbles the football, and it's recovered by Slaughter at the 34-yard line. Not what the Texans needed right now. A late fumble, giving the Jags the ball back, and Taylor gets very close to the first down there. Second and inches, Taylor breaking a couple tackles, juking, and he is going to take this one all the way. And just like that, we've got a tie ball game here in the fourth quarter, 24-24. And the Texans were just up 24 to 10. See if Carson Palmer. Oh, there's Larry Johnson back in the ball game. And gets a nice carry. Here's Billy Miller wide open. Past the 40. Past midfield. Breaking a couple tackles to the 46. Well, let's see if Palmer can lead his team to a game winning drive. Off to a great start with a nice run from Larry Johnson and a great run after the catch for Mr. Billy Miller. And Miller with another catch, picks up six yards. Second and four, two minutes to go. Wide receiver reverse pass. And Gaffney's actually gonna, th no, he's gonna take off and run it. Runs through a defender and gets up to the 26 yard line. Looked like he was gonna throw it and decided to run through Fernando Bryant instead. Palmer to the air, wide open. Billy Miller inside the 20 yard line. And the Texans continue to drive. Larry Johnson up the middle. Still going. And he'll get the first down. Jacksonville calls a timeout. And a great catch by Larry Johnson. I don't think I've ever seen this animation before in this game. A great diving catch. Third and inches. Johnson gets the first down. And we are able to run the clock down. And kick a field goal with Max to pace. And we walk out of here with the 27 to 24 victory over our division rivals, the Jacksonville Jaguars. And it should not have been that close. We were up two touchdowns and they ended up scoring two touchdowns to tie it up late in the game. And just an unacceptable fumble by Palmer. And I'm not even gonna complain about the secondary anymore. It is what it is. We can't cover anybody, it's fine. We're just going to keep moving on. Charles Tillman, nice uh, seven tackle game, one pick, one touchdown. 416 yards of offense, over 200 passing and 200 rushing for Houston today. Nineteen minutes, time of possession. And we shut the Jags out in the first and third quarter today. Palmer, 223 yards, one touchdown, 15 of 20. Willie Parker runs for 143 yards on 14 carries with a touchdown today in his first game of significant playing time in his career. He also had two broken tackles and a long of 77 yards. And he had 74 receiving yards on four catches. That's good for an 18.5 yard average. Randy Moss, three catches, 57 yards, one touchdown. Billy Miller, three for 36. TJ Hushmanzada with a drop today. Edwin Mulatalo allows two sacks. And our secondary has three of the top tacklers. Three sacks today, two for Will Smith, one for Marcus Washington. Jamie Sharper had a pick, and so did Charles Tillman. Bunch of deflections, all from the secondary. And they still got torched. Will Smith had a forced fumble today. Max to pace. You're killing me, buddy. Two for four. My goodness. A long of 23. Not a very good season for Max to pace this year. But let's take a look at the Week 15 results. Steelers beat the Cowboys. Dolphins beat the Browns. Chiefs beat the Raiders. Redskins beat the Eagles. Pack beat the Vikings. Giants beat the Saints. We won. The Bengals beat the Ravens. Patriots beat the Jets, and the 49ers beat the Buccaneers 6-0. Outstanding offense. 
Titans beat the Chargers. Bears beat the Lions. They're 7-7. Seven seven. Seahawks win. Panthers lose. And the Bills beat the Rams. Week 16, we take on the Oakland Raiders in Oakland. That'll be out tomorrow. I'll see you guys then. Take it easy.